Let me say something that might piss off a few people. If you're trading on the same kind of computer that your kid uses for TikTok, you're already losing. Not losing on trades necessarily, but losing speed. And in trading, speed is money. The average computer you bought on sale at Best Buy, it's choking every time your charts update. It's dragging every time you send an order. It's the equivalent of running the Indy 500 in a grocery cart. Today, I'm gonna to give you the ultimate checklist for new trading computers in 2025. Not the fluff you hear on forums, but the exact specs I'd give to my best friend if he came to me. I'm gonna tell you the only three CPUs worth buying here in 2025. I'm gonna tell you what kind of storage loads your charts instantly. I'm gonna tell you what's the right motherboard, what's the right graphics card, what's the correct operating system. Some people are still running on Windows 10 and the kind of tech support that you should demand. Because let's be honest, most tech support sucks. Let's start with the brain of the operation, the central processing unit or the processor or the CPU for short. If your processor can't crunch numbers instantly, it doesn't matter how fancy the rest of your system is. It's like putting a Prius engine in a Ferrari body. Here are the top three processors for trading in 2025. Number one, the Intel Core Ultra 7 265K. Blazing single core speed, which is what trading platforms love. Perfect for multiple charting platforms, live feeds, and news streams all at once. Number two, the Intel Ultra 9 285K. More cores, more threads, more headrooms for future proofing. Think of it as a turbocharged version of the Ultra 7 265K. Again, you're future-proofing your machine probably for five years. And number three, the AMD Ryzen 9 9950X 3D. This thing is a monster. Massive cache and insane multi-thread performance. It eats complex backtests and indicator-heavy layouts for breakfast. And here's a kicker. All three of these are AI-ready. That means they have specialized AI acceleration cores that can run AI trading tools, pattern recognition and analytics locally without shipping your data off to some slow cloud server. Next, let's talk about storage. If you're still running your trading software from a regular hard drive, you know, those old school spinning hard drives, stop. That's like trying to stream Netflix on dialogue. You need something called an NVMe SSD. They're lightning fast. They open your platform in milliseconds and they load massive data files instantly. No lag, no spinning wheels, just go. The next item on the checklist is the motherboard. The motherboard is the backbone of the whole system. Basically, you wanna go with Asus, MSI, or Gigabyte. If you choose the Gigabyte, look for the ultra durable line. It's built with better capacitors and stronger thermal design. Translation, fewer random crashes and longer life. And when the market's moving fast, you cannot afford your computer to have a bad day. Now, before I keep going deep, if you want every detail about trading computer specs, including which ones match your exact style of trading, I've put together the complete guide to trading computers. It's free, it's detailed, it'll save you from wasting thousands on the wrong hardware. Grab it now, the link is in the description. While you're down there, hit that subscribe button because I drop new videos like this all the time and missing them potentially could cost you thousands in trades. All right, let's talk about section four, which is RAM. Your random access memory is like your desk space. If your desk is too small, you're stacking papers on the floor. 32 gigabytes of RAM is the absolute minimum for serious traders. Anything less, and you'll hit slowdowns the moment you open too many charts or start too many back tests alongside news streamers. Now let's talk about the graphics card. I recommend an NVIDIA RTX 5060 or higher. Why? Because number one, it drives multiple high resolution monitors without breaking a sweat. And two, it's because it has AI ready tensor cores. These tensor cores are going to be a huge deal in the near future. Trading software is evolving. AI chart pattern recognition, real time risk analysis, and automated trade filtering will all tap into these cores for lightning fast results. Buy a card without them and you'll be upgrading again way sooner than you want. All right, let's talk about the operating system. And I don't understand why people are still running on Windows 10. 
It's at the end of its life. At the bare minimum, you want Windows 11, not because it's trendy, but because the newest processors are optimized for it. You get better performance, better stability, and security right out of the gate. Now, let's talk about the warranty and the technical support, because here is the ugly truth. Most tech support sucks. These people read from scripts. They don't understand your trading business. And by the time they get back to you, you've already missed the trade. You need a premium warranty and a premium style of lifetime tech support from people who know trading. Someone who has your back, who can troubleshoot your system in plain English, and who treats your uptime like it's their uptime. So here is your ultimate checklist review. The three fastest AI-ready processors, NVMe SSD storage, rock-solid motherboards, enough RAM to run your empire, and a graphics card built for the AI future. Windows 11 for maximum performance, and of course, and not least, support that actually supports you people who speak your language, people who have your back when something goes wrong. Remember, get the complete guide to trading computers if you haven't yet. The link is in the description below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, seriously? Come on, man, do it now, because the video you must watch next is my deep dive on processors for trading. And it's right here. And I'll show you what the spec sheets don't tell you and the expensive mistakes traders make all the time. I'm Eddie Z, and I'll see you in the next video.